the land means so much to us. Like, um, like the land before meant so much to our ancestors and our great, you know, forefathers. I think they're trying to say in their paintings how it is that they see their land. And in those paintings open up their view of the land, their relationship with it, their relationship to the trees, to the food, to the water, to the skies, to non-Aboriginal eyes, and show us a view of the universe which is quite unique. So I, I think often what people are talking about in their art is that special relationship that they have to country, um, to the ancestral sites in their country, but also their social responsibility to those places to maintain them and to look after them. And as a social group to perform ceremonies which, you know, reinforces those connections and makes them strong as a group. So the art, the ideas, the land, everything reinforces its, you know, each other. It's a, it's a unified concept um, to, to the world. It's a much more integrated and holistic attitude than what we may have because we tend to put things into boxes or compartments. But Aboriginal people see it all very much as a unified whole. I would be, um, would be very happy, would be very happy for the white fellas to, you know, come forward to us and would be happy to share this knowledge of the land and of our paintings, what the meaning of a painting is. And maybe, you know, we shouldn't have a gap there, that we should be all, you know, together equal as one.